This week on Stadia Blog brings us more implementation across even more devices, big free to play weekend and juicy sales. See our two's reaction, Stadia Direct Touch lands on iOS and more big sales. It's SDO Daily, baby. Let's get into this one. What's up, people? What's up, people? What's up, people? It is your boy, MM2K of the Stadia Doses platform and PNTS Network, here to welcome you to another SDO Daily. Can you do us a huge favor before we get into this one? First, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and rock those bells for notifications, please. That way you know when we're dropping these doses. We appreciate all y'all straight up. Y'all know the deal, y'all know the reason. And by now, y'all should know the slogan. We are not too proud to ask. Let's get into today's video. All right. So this week on Stadia blog released today, it got some interesting stuff into it, um, or in it rather, and we're gonna get into it by breaking it down in three parts. First, we're gonna go over the blog. We're gonna talk about the sales associated to the blog, and we're gonna give our overall thoughts on this entry this week, all right? So first and foremost, let's talk about the blog post. You know how we do. Let me show you something. All right. This week on Stadia, it reads, Destiny 2, Ben 10 Power Trip in Free Play Days. Okay, as the days get longer, or get shorter, excuse me, the list of reasons to play Stadia just keeps getting longer. Check out what's happening on Stadia this week. First, Destiny 2 Season 15, The Festival of the Lost, the roar of hashtag Team Dino Heralds to start, of the Festival of the Lost today, dress your dino best while you hunt for the new Jurassic Green Pulse Rifle, new masks, and a crypt's worth of spectacular cosmetics, brave new tales of terror, and the haunted sector activity, and complete the new book of the forgotten. Also, go on a power trip with Ben 10. On October 15th, Ben 10 Power Trip launches on Stadia. And what a trip it's going to be. Ben and his family are enjoying their European, va uh, European vacation until the evil magician Hex unleashes the power of four mysterious crystals. As Ben, you're the only one who can break the curse. You'll transform into powerful aliens to battle enemies, solve puzzles, and freely explore on exciting 3D world. Get it on Stadia for $29.99 USD. Mayhem, get your free mayhem here. Newsflash, we got Borderlands 3 play weekend coming your way from October 14th at 9 a.m. PT or um, to October 18th at 9 a.m. PT. For Stadia Pro subscribers, the original shooter looter is yours to play as much as you want during this mayhem fueled guns blazing adventure. All right, blast through new worlds and enemies as one of the four vault hunters, the ultimate treasure seeking bad asses of the borderlands each with deep skill trees abilities and customization play solo or join friends to take an insane enemies score loads of loot and save your home from the ruthless cult leaders in the galaxy if you're not a stadia pro subscriber you can become one and they provide a link for you to do so also Direct Touch Input Method now available to play with iOS. Direct Touch is a Stadia input method released in August on Android, allowing you to interact directly with the game using your phone's touchscreen. Now it's available for Stadia players on iOS. Direct Touch allows players to control the game by tapping, sliding, and pinching the screen. Try it now on Humankind, where you can create your own civilization using just your fingers. Also, check out the new party feature on Stadia. Parties are expanding with a new way to meet up with players. In addition to private parties, we're introducing public parties. Find players who like to play the same games as you and connect with them. And that's it for the direct blog. However, there are some fantastic sales that are on this week, right? That are associated to the blog each week. And man, oh man, oh man, you definitely don't want to miss these. Check this out. Shout out to our good friend, Brian Chappelle. 
of the Nerf Report. He puts out a post on Twitter. He says, weekly Google Stadia sales are now live. Look at this stuff, man. Oh, you got Elder Scrolls, Blackwood, CE Upgrade, $24.99 instead of it being $50, for instance. You got Ghost Recon, Wildlands for 20 bucks instead of it being 50. Breakpoint is 24 bucks instead of it being 60. Excuse me, I'm, yeah, it's, it's, instead of it being 60. Uh, you got the Star Pack, that's on sale for $7. WWE 2K Battlegrounds is on sale for 16 bucks instead of 40. Let's continue on. You also got Madden on sale for about 40 bucks. Marvel's Avengers on sale for 20. You can get the end game, end game edition for about 39 bucks instead of 60. Red Dead Redemption's on uh, Red Dead Redemption 2, that is, is on sale. Now here goes a controversial one, Outriders. Outriders is on sale for $36. But here's what I'm gonna say. You might wanna entertain getting this one. Unless, because that November update is coming around soon, and that November update is supposed to address all this stuff. So you might wanna entertain getting that one. Those are just my thoughts. You got some more Elder Scroll stuff. Also, you got Dirt 5 on sale for only $17.99, holy cow. You got Grid on sale for nine bucks. Hitman 2 on sale for $12. I might have to snatch that one up. All right, and then you can get an expansion pass for another $10. All right, and then Hitman 3 Deluxe Pack is on sale for 21 bucks. The standard edition is on sale for 30. And last but not least, you got games like Blue Fire, Borderlands 3, the aforementioned game that's going to get the free play weekend on sale for 20 bucks and just a lot of Borderlands stuff in relation to that. So this is a hell of a sale. All right. Lastly, what are our thoughts on all this, right? Um, I think it was a good blog. Not a lot of new um, games that are out there. Really, I think Ben 10 is the only new game, but it's great to see Borderlands 3, that highly, highly, highly critically acclaimed game. It's, it's great to remind people, hey, this is on Stadia. You can play this on any screen. Try it out for free. It's always great to do that. Um, I think Ben 10 is the only free new game that was announced this week, but that could be a lot of fun for different people. Uh, re reminding people that the Destiny 2 events, I think is good as well. So I, overall, I think it's a, it's a good week. It's a good week. Um, for a blog post. I think what really made this week are, is the Borderlands 3 free-to-play weekend and definitely those sales. Those sales are kind of crazy, man. So definitely check them out. And those are our thoughts. But let us know what you think about all this in the comment section below. Because like we always say, who cares what I think? But if you did like what I had to say, check out the links below to follow me. Those links will lead you to the Broadband Bullies, PNTS Network, Hard Knock Digital Culture, and Yes to Stadia Dosage. With all that said, appreciate love all of y'all. Until next time, have a wonderful gaming day. Peace.